Three signs you're a people pleaser at work and it might be ruining your career. Number one, you tell small lies all the time to make everybody else feel more comfortable. For example, let's say your team just successfully pitched a client and they're like, hey, let's go out to a fancy Italian dinner. Do you like Italian? And you're like, yeah, I love Italian. No, you don't. You're allergic to gluten and dairy. And they're like, you need to try this fettuccine Alfredo. So you're like, mm, yum. And then you're sick the next day and you can't go to work. Number two, you don't share your true opinion in group settings because you want to maintain harmony. Let's say the team wants to pitch the client something they're really excited about, but you have data to prove that that is a bad idea. But everybody seems really excited about it, so you just figure you'll just keep your mouth closed and your opinion to yourself. Who knows? Maybe you're wrong. You weren't wrong. The pitch goes horribly and the company loses the client. Number three, you drop everything to help anybody at any time. Let's say you're working from home on your little computer and you start getting Slack messages and you're up against a tight deadline. And your coworker's like, I need help. So you drop everything, hop on Zoom, and of course, because you're a people pleaser, you have a 30 minute conversation. You finally get off Zoom and you missed your deadline. Remember, other people's emotions aren't your responsibility to manage.